Hello, and welcome to another Imaginet Tech Tip. My name is Leo Labayan, Civil Specialist at Imaginet. In this video, we will show how to edit a pressure pipe slope on a part-based system, and how to overcome a known issue. The issue is only encountered when editing the older part-based pipe elements, where the slope value is exaggerated regardless of what the vertical exaggeration value is set in the profile view. In this example, uh, the current slope value for the pressure pipe is 5%. The goal here is to edit it to a value of 2. But when that value is used, it is exaggerated and a value of 200% is then shown. The workaround here is simple, is to reduce the desired value by a factor of 10, that is 0 0.02 to achieve a result on screen of 2%. Let's jump into Civil 3D and see how this all works out. In this example, you'll notice that we have two pressure networks. The newer method, denoted by this blue pipe here, is based upon pipe runs. And if you attempt to use the change slope option, you'll notice that it gives you the option or notification that this command is intended for part-based pressure networks and will not operate correctly on a path-based pressure network. So we're going to use this network over here, which is a part-based denoted by yellow. And if we go into the pipe properties, you will notice that the value is clearly shown a value of 5%. To edit a slope, we cannot directly edit it. We would either edit the inverts or use the tool that we just saw. Let's go in here and explore that tool trying to modify this, I will again here go to the profile base edit, change the slope on this part, and let's use a value of 2. Enter. You will notice that on screen that value is exaggerated to a 200% as shown in plan and this profile view. Not quite the result that we wanted to get. Let's try this again. I'm going to go back here and change the slope, select that same part, Choose the upslope. Let's edit it this time by a 0 0.02 per value. And as you'll notice, it then changes to a nice even 2% simply by doing the math beforehand. And we can see that this is correct by going to the pipe properties and you'll notice that that value is then obeyed of 2%. I hope you found this information valuable for your day-to-day -day design work. Thank you for your time. Please visit our website for more features and productivity tips for all industries.